Hi everyone, this is Brian with Anderson Pens, and today I want to take a look at the Visconti Rembrandt collection. Let's take a look. Okay, here we have the Visconti Rembrandt collection. It comes in six standard colors. We have red, orange, ivory, purple, black, and blue. And these aren't really all solid colors. There's always a little bit of a mix in each one. For example, the black has a little bit of gray. You can kind of see it here in the cap. Uh, blue's got some some lighter blue in it. Ivory's got some brown mixed in. Uh, just enough to make it interesting. If it were a solid color, it might be might be a little bit too plain. Um, red's got a little black, maybe a little white in the in the end there. So a nice a nice subtle mix. Um, let's take a look at the pen. Uh, steel trim. Uh, you've got the black background on the, the Visconti on the arch clip. Uh, and these are nice clips. They're, they have a lot of springs, so you can see I can open that up quite a bit. Um, these do almost require a, a different style to put in your, in your pocket because they fit flush to the cap, so you can't just slide it into your pocket like you can some other pens. But with a clip like this, you can put it in your, your, your jeans pocket, or you can put it if you've got a shirt that's a little bit thicker. You don't, you don't have to worry. This thing will, will slide in easily. Um, it has uh, Rembrandt on the cap band on the top, and a little design there. And on the top, it does utilize uh, the My Pen system. So if you wanted to, you could remove this uh, jewel here. With uh, comes with a, you can remove it with a magnet. Uh, you could get your initials. Um, there are a number of other uh, components to the My Pen system, uh, jewels and precious metals and things like that that you can put in there uh, to, to personalize your pen. And we've got a sort of a pseudo matching jewel on the end that's not removable. Kind of finishes it off here. Uh, cap is magnetic, just like the Van Gogh's, which is kind of nice. And it stays, it stays together, you know, it's pretty tight. So pretty strong. Um, it posts nice and securely. This thing's not coming off. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, there's no question about it. Uh, and because it's magnetic, there are no threads, of course, which makes finding your, your place on the pen uh, quite easy. You don't have to worry about getting uh, those threads digging into your fingers. It's got this little tiny little bump here. I don't even want to call it a step. Uh, it's real smooth, so even if you hold it this far back, and I don't know many people that do, you won't have a problem with it. So, metal section. Um, it does have a steel Visconti nib, and it's got that nice, beautiful pattern on there. And the nib is simply friction fit, nib and feed, plastic feed. So if you want to clean it, you can pull it right out and, uh, and do that. Super easy. Uh, pen is a cartridge converter. Uh, uses international size. Nice big converter. And uh, let's, uh, before we Let's do a writing sample. Let's take a look at uh, pen. Also does come in ballpoints and rollerballs, and I happen to have the ballpoints here. Um, same six colors, has a twist action mechanism. Nice little spring to it. And if you rotate it the other way, it unscrews. And you've got your standard Parker style refill. So you notice it's got that little ratcheting type in there. So Parker style refills can be found pretty much everywhere. So if you are if you haven't stocked up and you're in an emergency, you can get them just about at any office supply store. Um, but uh, same same clip, uh, really just a really nice, a nice uh, classy looking ballpoint, I think, with a little bit of flair. Let's, uh, let's ink this guy up and uh, and see how it writes. This one happens to be a medium nib. And we are going to use for this experiment Visconti Blue. Now, if you've never seen or used these bottles before, you see it's got the, the Visconti V style bottle. Um, it's a little platform that the, that the bottle sits in, but as you can see, it, it can get kind of tipsy. Um, this is a great bottle for filling your pen all the way down to the bottom because it just funnels it right down to the end here. Um, but uh, it can be tricky to, to 
to hold the bottle to make sure it doesn't tip over. So especially when you got one hand on the pen, one hand on the converter. So what a uh, little trick we found is you can just do this. You can put it right inside, invert the, the top part of the, the container and just slide it in. Now this won't, this won't slip out. So I'm gonna unscrew this. Yeah, put it like that. That way you, can hit, you don't have to worry about that. You can keep your hands on the pen. Okay, just had to step away for a second there. I had to get a something to wipe the pen off. I didn't have it handy, so uh, let's move this off to the side. Cap my ink, and let's. Uh, it's a really, really smooth medium nib here. Um, For a steel nib, it's really it's really outstanding. There's no, I don't really feel much of anything in the way of feedback. I am using a, a Visconti test pad. Um, it's a firm nib. But there is no, um, there is no flex to it. I mean, I guess you, you could. I, I never recommend it, but there's not enough to make it make it worthwhile in my opinion. Um, this is just your, your, your everyday. Good, uh, good writing daily carry pen. Just doing a real quick, quick sample there. You can see it's pretty, pretty consistent line width. Um, and this is uh, Visconti blue, what a beautiful color. Um, actually it's one of my favorites, it's a real solid blue. It's not, uh, some blues have a, a little tinge of purple to them. Uh, uh, like Aurora Blue is a, is a great, great blue, but it's a little got a little purple to it. Sometimes I just want solid blue. So um, I'll use a Viscotti Blue. But if you need a, a good, solid, dependable pen to put in your in your case to take notes with at work, um, this is it. You can see it sits nicely in the hand, posted. Uh, I usually post my pens. Um, but on occasion, if I'm, I'm in a hurry and I need to jot some note down, I just, you know, I may hang on to it with my, my left hand while I write uh, a quick note. Sometimes it doesn't, doesn't pay to post it because I'm just, I'm, I'm writing down two or three, three words and that's it. But uh, uh, it's pretty comfortable. It's, uh, I've got larger hands, so you can see it, uh, it still covers, covers that gap there, um, holding on to this section there. So. Really nice, very smooth nib. Um, it's quite impressive, actually. Um, but uh, there it is, the Rembrandt collection from Visconti. So there you have it, the Visconti Rembrandt collection. Be sure to check us out online at andersonpens.com, in the store, or at any of a number of pen shows nationwide.